Now, mention our American cousins, and most people think weaponry, donuts, racism, and brown paper shopping bags with no handles. What's all that about? <laughs> oh dear, I thought you were having a stroke there. But there's much more to America than that. Time for New SA, our first regular update on the state of the states. We're joined by our very own Ruth Duggan for a segment as American as Mum's apple pie. I you were and a who stroke. doesn't love Mum's apple pie? Well, I'm sure I would. I'm not I'm your mum, but I, I imagine a kind of Nanette Newman type, <laughs> uh, crimping crusts and cutting out love hearts from excess pastry to plonk on the top of the, the pie lid. Something like that. What about your mum's? <laughs> well, I love my mum, but um, I, I have to say she made bad pies. And uh, even though she loved me, she managed to make a pie without putting any love into it whatsoever. So, yeah, just you know, chopped apples, pastry, lots of brown sugar, but as I say, no love. Uh, uh, but Ruth, I bet you loved your mum's apple pie. First up, police raid a house in Cleveland and find four dead men in a septic tank. Not the kind of story anyone likes. I do, actually. I love anything like that. Right. <laughs> Absolutely delicious. Uh, you're right. You mean the apple pie. And the same, though, Ruth. All the pastry turns into a fat back. Well, quite. It's been described as a truly gruesome sight. What? A vision of hell. Dismembered limbs from as oh, many right. as... You, I think you've so got a bit of delay on the line. a bit of delay on the line. Copycat. So I'll just, I'll just try and soldier on as best... Sorry, I didn't quite catch that. It's all right. I was just saying the same thing as you said. I should just... Try and push on and assume that you can hear. Yep, go ahead, Alan. No, you go ahead. Shall you, I go ahead. So you go ahead. You go ahead. You go ahead. It's like trying to have a chat on a webcam with someone in the Philippines. Or bloody anywhere in the world. Yes. Uh, sorry, after you. Uh, no, Ruth, stop talking. We're starting again. Not when you get this. Now, Ruth, hello. Hello. Good. Do you like your mum's apple pie? Yes. And I believe the police have found the remains of four dead men in a house in Cleveland. Yes, that's right. Well, tell us about it and give us a long answer so we don't have to keep going back and forth. Now? Yes, now. I should knock on the side of your box. Oh. Well, Ignore as I the said, box thing. it's a grisly discovery. And while the identities of the men haven't been... Con Sorry, the side of my box. The owner of the house has been named locally as 51-year-old Brian Crilly, now the subject of a full-scale manhunt. Well, Ruth, I think we'll leave it there for today. Thank you. You're welcome, Jenny. Uh, I'll let you go and enjoy the sunshine. <laughs> Too hot for me, I'm afraid. <laughs> you back with us next week? The week after. See you then. Bye-bye. Ruth Duggan there, and apologies if there were any technical glitches. I think we got it sorted out in the end.